I was comfortable in taking the picture during the shoot, but then when I got the picture back, I was horrified because I saw this fat hair on my face, and I thought, oh, I look so big, I just look so, I look so chunky, and I look like a big girl, and that was the worst. I never wanted to be called a big girl. Women seem to be set up for inevitable failure by themselves and by men who so heavily value appearance without acknowledging the fact that everyone ages. Barbie dolls. Okay, when I was little, um, I used to be even jealous that they were so perfect then. So I used to have them totally naked and I would tie a string around their neck and there was a stream that ran down our street. And I used to drag them up and down the street saying that they were swimming. And then when I lifted them back up, the street had shaved their boobs off. And I was like, yes, if I can't have boobs, neither can they. So began my journey to find out if I was alone. I wanted to see how women really feel about their bodies, why, and if anyone knew of a secret for a healthy body image and high self-esteem. In LA, honestly, like there are not a lot of people that are like 12 and over, but um, four or six is the most popular size, yeah. Most people don't realize that size 14 is the number one dress size in America, that 80% of American women are size 14, not size six and eight. The plus size clothing sales reached 23 billion last year and it's up 20% since 1994. I figured out that if I've been doing my hair and makeup for an hour a day, five days a week since I was 16, now at 40, I've spent almost a year and a half of my life putting on makeup and doing my hair. I, I really don't, I, honestly, I really don't think there, there is a perfect ideal woman's body. I think it's really, it's, it's in the eye of the beholder. I'm, I'm attracted to pretty much everything. <laughs> what are they going to do to your chest? Um, it's going to be a D cup. We're, I'm getting it augmented. And I just got my nose up. <laughs> got it bobbed, so still a little swollen. It's kind of senseless. I mean, I mean, it's good to look good and it's good to have a nice body, but that's not the point in life to do your work your entire life to look absolutely perfect and great and wonderful. The point in life is to go out and have fun.